Well, now new at 4.30, a multi-million dollar tunnel three miles under Columbus City Streets has finally reached the finish line. Now, this is a story we first showed you back in December, a massive project to handle excess rain and sewage as the city grows. The Lower Olentangy Tunnel is designed to prevent sewage from entering the Olentangy and Cider Rivers, which is why the Ohio EPA mandated that the Columbus City build it. Well, today, 10 TV reporter Kevin Landers was there when the massive drill bit bore through the earth at the end of his three and a half mile journey. This $16 million drill bit has been digging under Columbus Street since February of last year. Now that the tunnel digging is almost over, the city can begin correcting a problem that's been dealing with for more than two decades. When Columbus gets heavy rains, that overwhelms the city's sewer lines, which were built in the 1800s. When that happens, sewage spills into the Olentangy River. This tunnel fixes that problem. The city's growing. And so with population growth and other things like that, we, we actually need added capacity. So they're not all just necessarily for overflow. Some of them are needed for capacity as well. The project is expected to divert approximately 100 to 150 million gallons of wastewater from entering the Olentangy River. That water will then be pumped into the wastewater treatment plant, where it will be pumped back into the Olentangy River. Kevin Landers, 10TV News.